our Father and our God, we give you thanks. We give you praise for this new day. Thank you for many blessings you sent to us. Thank you for you bless us in many ways. Thank you for increasing our knowledge of you on daily basis. Thank you for increasing our love of you on daily basis. Thank you for another day. Accept our thanksgiving in the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I decree and I pray that today you shall enter into the next level. The next level of your breakthrough the next level of blessing, the next level of favor, the next level of mercy, the next level of provision. I pray that the Lord will take you to your own place. All shall be well with you today. All shall be well in your home. All shall be well in your career. All shall be well in your business. This day shall yield for you. It shall yield abundance. It shall yield blessings. It shall yield results and not excuses. You shall have good report today. You shall have good result. You shall have abundance. God shall visit you with his plenty. In the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I decree and I declare that today your life will attract divine assistance. Your family will attract divine assistance. Every member of your family shall receive divine help today. God will help you in all that you do. The Lord will help you in your business. The lines will fall for you in pleasant places. You will be preferred above your colleagues. You will be the most preferred above all. You will be the most favored of men in the name of the Lord Jesus. There was a day that Joseph started his day in the prison and ended it in the palace. I decree and I pray that today will be that day for you. You will end today in the palace of grace, the palace of mercy, the palace of fulfillment. You, I mean you, we never, never go down. In the name of the Lord Jesus, the dungeon is not your place. Shame is not your portion. Disgrace does not belong to you. Your place is a place of greatness. Your place is a place of appreciation. This day, God will grant you spiritual visitation. He will grant you special testimonies. God will grant you special promotion today. He will visit you with his signs and wonders and bless you mightily. I decree and I pray that God will open the windows of heaven over you. The Lord will open the doors of heaven over you and he will pour out blessings upon you. You will have no cause to regret this day. Your heaven is already open and it shall remain permanently open. Your heaven will not close again. What is meant for you this day shall not be given to another person. What is meant for you in life shall not be given to another person. The program of the wicked shall never come to pass in your life. I decree and I pray powers that are assigned to silence your voice shall be arrested today. Your voice of testimony, your voice of victory shall never, never be silenced. 
no power shall derail the course of your life. Today, no power shall derail you. No power shall destroy you. In the name of the Lord Jesus, no power shall stop you from manifesting God's glory. I decree and I pray that spiritual gates will open for you and good things will manifest in your life. You will rule in the midst of your enemies. This day you shall prosper all around in the name of Jesus Christ. I decree and I pray that the Lord will perfect all that concern you. In the name of the Lord Jesus, thank you, Heavenly Father. Blessed be your name. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen, amen, and amen.